powers and exponents. A power is the product of repeated multiplication. So for example, 5 cubed is a power. This whole thing is a power. The 5 is the base, and the 3 is the exponent. And that's equal to, we said repeated multiplication. So the base is what gets multiplied three times. And we say it's 5 to the third power. And we don't add. I don't know why, but many people decide they want to add when they see this. It means 5 times 5 times 5, which is 125. Here are some more powers. This is 3 to the power of 2, or you can say 3 squared. This is 3 to the power of 3, or you can say 3 cubed. And then this one is 3 to the power of 4, and it doesn't have a fancy name. It's just 3 to the power of 4. Or if you had 3 to the power of 5, there's no fancy name for that one. 3 to the power of 6, and so on. Only the power of 2 and the power of 3 have special names. Write 12 times 12 times 12 times 12 as a power. Well, the number we're multiplying is 12. So that's the base. And then there are four of them, so that becomes the exponent. So this is 12 to the power of 4. Write 4 times 4 times 4 times 4 times 4 times 4 as a power. Again, our base is 4, and we have 6 of them, so that would be 4 to the power of 6. Write 3 times 3 times 3 times 3 times a times a times a times b as a power. We have different bases here, so we have to do it in steps. We have 3 is a base, and there's 4 of them, so that's 3 to the power of 4. The a's do not go with the 3's, so we just put times a, and how many a's are there? There are 3, so put 3 as the power, or the exponent, times b, and there's only one b. So you could write a 1, or just leave it off, because if you see it, it means that there's just one of them. So the answer is 3 to the 4th power times a cubed times b. Find the value of 4 to the 3rd power, or 4 cubed. A lot of people get excited and they say 4 times 3 equals 12. That is not the right way to do this. Powers are repeated multiplication, so you have 4 times 4 times 4. The base is 4, the exponent's 3, so that's why there's 3 of them. And then you do 4 times 4 is 16, times this last 4, 16 times 4 is 64. Evaluate means the same thing as find the value. It even has value right there in it, so find the value or evaluate. 2 cubed times 5 squared. So write it out. 2 times 2 times 2. That's 2 cubed times 5 times 5. That's 5 squared. 2 times 2 is 4. Times 2 again is 8, not 6. We're multiplying, not adding. Times 5 times 5 is 25. And then 8 times 25 is 200.